how about Shum Yom Shah, by Shum Kakwadash. Uh, this is a video that was put up on August 7th, actually yesterday, entitled, this is on Vocab Malone's page, entitled, An Eyewitness Account of Hebrew Israelite History, Vital Live. And, um, I don't think this is the second part of an uh, interview with Ad Adiala. So maybe what he did was cut out some of the main uh, live that he did. But he focused on, I'm, I'm at the uh, 10 minute 24 second mark of a 2 minute 18, a 2 hour 18 minute uh, 58 second video. Like I said, I'm at the 10 minute 24 second mark. And um, Vocab Malone goes into uh, the book of Ezra. You know, in the Bible, not the, the Apocrypha. And he um, reads from the second verse, 60, second chapter, 64 verse. And He's trying to say that uh, this is a fulfillment of um, Isaiah uh, chapter 14. So I'm going to let you listen, and I'm going to go into to the scriptures. So listen up. Amongst the darkness, you know, a lot of times people, no matter what nation they are, no matter... Uh, what people you find dark people that's in darkness everywhere you find e evil people everywhere and I found this out uh, a lot of this stuff out after I came out of one west also you can't just pinpoint and say yo this so he said he found out a lot of things after he left one west meaning he turned his back on the plow so he's just on his own you know, Adial is not out there on the highways and the byways. He's just uh, some lost soul out there. These people is evil. These, this people is, is really, when you look at it, is these people are evil, not is evil. People are, are plural. Good and bad amongst all nations. So I'm a go um and you're saying one, so you're saying that brother because um under the old one west breakdowns you have eighteen nations total, one of whom of yeah. course is Israel. But these yeah. other nations, these seventeen other nations, are all nations that are doomed by their ethnicity, they were uh, designed and destined ultimately to be slaves and servants of the Israelites forever and cannot experience any, any kind of salvation other than being slaves in the kingdom. And uh, they essentially are created uh, wicked to varying degrees. The most wicked of all, I think most one Westerners would say would probably be the Amalekites, and then they would say, uh, the Edomites, and they would say they have, they have a wicked nature, basically by design. That's who they are. There's no chance of redemption. Somewhat similar. Exactly, and that's.